What's going on guys? My name is Renegade. Today we're here to play through the uh, Flying Bacon Cats Fortress event. Uh, it's the latest part in the Throne of Darkness series. So we'll just jump straight into it. Didn't have any problems like we did uh, with the last part where I uh, accidentally lost all my uh, all my recordings. I had to re-record it with not my first reactions. My first reactions this time. I haven't, I haven't seen any spoilers or anything. I've had like three images sent to me on Twitter, but I didn't really look at them that much. So, Oh god, that's loud. Alright. Alright, so back around the table again. Jesus, this sound is quite loud. I turn it down. Alright. Ziri and the flying... Uh, Siri. It's Siri. Alright. Siri, you said you made Etho dead? Yep, I wished him dead right on the spot. And you're sure anything you wish for instantly becomes true. Ziri's a one... Siri... Uh, Siri's a one-man Make-A-Wish Foundation. But you're a Sneebel. Quiet, Vaden. Siri's not like those other box junkies. Siri's different. I don't know why I'm reading these. Do I need to read these? I don't know if I need to read these. I'm going to read these, okay? And then tell me how cancerous they were, okay? Uh, Siri is different. Think, Siri. Siri's wishes are the best. Are you crazy or do you actually believe what you're saying? Why not both? Are you going to tell us how you killed Etho or not, Sneevil? Gasp. Yeah, I'm just going to say. I'm not even going to say, like, the. The, the things, I'm never gonna like, like, do like the actual gasp, I'm just gonna say gasp. Get, get, you get, you get it triggered. You get it triggered. I love how, uh, Seven's still a fucking, a little kid. Siri wishes you had a, a Whittle Frogzard arm so you can't even do push-ups. Oh. And Siri wishes you talked an all in lowercase because, OMG, what is wrong with your claps lock? Why you little, I am going to... Siri, why are you being so rude? What? Ugh. Siri wishes you'd grow up. Hey, she's back to normal again. It's too stuffy in, the, in this dank castle. Hey. <laughs> yep, she, he said dank, so I, I went full retard. Siri wishes we were at the beach. Wow. You little green snot. I wish you, Hey, he's not talking. Oh, oh no, never mind. Was that? Yeah, that's that guy now. Yeah, yeah. She just shut up. No, Siri wishes you'd shut up. I can only use can. <laughs> That's actually really good. <laughs> I'm, I'm kind of sick, so when I laugh, I cough. Okay, listen up, everyone. This is Siri's story. It starts in your guys in, where Siri went to confront Etho personally. Wow. Bacon cat. Oh, 64. Damn, people are playing this, the shit out of this event. I am here for you. Let's look at the shop first, I guess. Uh, is this rare stuff? No. Kitty gown. All right. Kitty clown face. Cool, cool. Bacon cat. Uh, alright. Look, it's, it's pretty shit stuff. Alright. Alright. Quests. Start doing these quests. How rude. Uh, Siri, wait a minute. Apparently, you heroes take their sweet time being a Sneevil. How rude. So, Siri left to amuse himself. Just had a little bit of mockingberry juice. Knock out the candles in the end. Okay, so I gotta put out the fires that Siri has made. Okay. So, I guess I just look around. Uh, I can't go upstairs. Alright. Uh, bam. Bam. Is there any back in this room? One. Two. Three. All right. Yeah, the music needs to be on. I can't go that way yet. Oh, I have to go up here to go up the stairs. All right, I guess there's gonna be some more up here. Cool. I love how they're actually in like the candle things, so they probably should be on fire, right? I don't know. I guess so. Turn that in. Okay, bar fight. Well, the hero's putting out Siri's fire. Siri took out his frustration on the patrons at the end. You know, see a bar is so strong. Everyone's hitting everyone, but the hero wanted to rain on that parade too. Started knocking everyone else so they couldn't find any more. Y'all got regular KO'd. Alright, so I get to kill regulars. Alright, easy enough. I can't go this way next. This way yet, I should say. Alright. Bam. Kill you guys. And you guys. I'm good at this game. I can kill these guys. Alright. Oh, they're in this room as well. I didn't even notice that. Okay. Uh, whoops. Uh, number two. While well, a hero was busy breaking up the fight, so I gotta find it. So these two barrels, I guess, have gotta have something in them, I suppose. Ah. Oh. These two barrels, then, I guess. Nope. What the fuck? They just disappeared. Alright. Fair enough. 
No, I could, uh... I guess I gotta check all these barrels. Oh god, I just opened that up. I don't wanna do that. Number two. Alright. Anything up here? No, you can't go in there. You can't go in there. Alright. Over here then. No. Where are the rest of the barrels then? There was the ones in the, in the starting room, but now they're not. They're not there anymore. Is this a bug? Wait, okay, let's just read the description for the quest again. I should probably do this. Oh, okay. So to kill these guys for that. He hit it in a regular's pocket. I don't know the, that Yelga served coffee. Really? Okay. Really? Still nothing. These regulars are ever gonna drop it? Like, mate, come on. Here we go. Okay. Nope. Don't wanna go there. Okay. Forget the mess. Monster defeated. Uh, so. So, I guess monsters are. Alright, here we go. One hit them, pretty much. Done. Easy peasy. Another cutscene. Alright. Then Ether was all like, I need to go. I need to go. Siri said, no problem. Come over to my squid ice cream underwater fortress. What the heck is wrong with you? <laughs> That's pretty great. Lots of things according to my... <laughs> oh my god, this is great. A squid ice cream underwater fortress? No, no, no. It was a flying bacon cat cloud palace. <laughs> yeah, that's it. I can't really use... <laughs> I brought Ether there to fulfill the bacon cat force prophecy. Prophecies are my thing. You can't just go stealing my thing. Siri wishes sex head... Sex head was a volleyball. <laughs> this. Oh no, Siri. Is... So we really need to talk. The big and cat force prophecy of Kitty Boo Boo. The overlord of the cat verse. <laughs> so it begins. Wow. Damn. Uh, my overlord, cat verse bacon cats ho. Um. My overlord. What? You didn't come up and chat? No? Alright. That's right. Siri had had transported the hero to the fabled Flying Bacon Cat Palace. First, the hero had to prove worthing, worthiness to enter its golden halls. How do you ask? How you ask? The hero had to guess the secret password. Alright. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. So, Bacon Cats, you've done the second half of the password. What? What did I? What? what? I, I, okay. Uh, all right. Uh. I'll just pass. All right. Bacon. Bacon. All right. Did I? Did I do it? Do I? What do I do now? Do I just? Pass, password correct. Do I? Do I? Oh, there we go. All right. Turn in. Sweet. Bacon pizza. Bacon pizza. Okay, I gotta kill these guys. I, I presume. Yep, I presumed correct. Bam. One hit these guys again. Treasure chest, why not? All right, we need more bacon than we do pizza, so I'm disappointed we only got one bacon there. Oh, I got three bacon here though. All right, cool, done. 
Okay, no more clowns. So, uh, Hera was the, was, the hero was the one spoken of in the Bacon Cat Prophecy, which means Hero is the one who will finally fight off the endless army of in infinite clowns. Go, Hero, go. Save the flying Bacon Cat Cloud Palace from the Grease Paint Onslaught. So, what? Uh, honking Clown Nose, Scary Face Paint, Rainbow Wig. Alright. Uh, am I finding the- am I- okay, let's just see if it's, they're gonna drop from here. No. Okay, so I'm gonna go find some- I'm gonna kill clowns. Am I? Yeah, there we go. These guys are slightly more difficult to kill. Which is good. I like how they're making these monsters, like, very easy to kill. Every level player could kill these guys, pretty much. Although I vaguely remember being quite challenged trying to kill a lot of these guys. Ah, uh, sorry, to kill uh, even the easiest of monsters while I was a very low level, so... You know. Uh, this is only- no, that's dropping all of them. I just need to keep staying in this room, I guess. I'll rest off a bit here. Don't really need to, though. Just launch straight back in. Um, alright. And, goodbye. Piggy Clown. Ah, fuck off. I don't like you. This music is quite repetitive. <laughs> just like last week. Last time, even. So it's, it's almost every two weeks this comes out. There's always a, um, an unrelated, like, not, like, to the main story part in between. Alright, quest done. Let's get this turned in. Okay. Life's a beach. When the hero found our beautiful beach, poop scooped. Uh, okay. So I guess I gotta poop, uh, scoop some poop. Fair enough. Make, it does make the beach look considerably... The, the beach, uh, I wouldn't really consider this a beach, but I guess they're all up, up in their beach get up, so I suppose I suppose this is a beach. Yeah, I guess it looks like a bit like a beach. It's quite grey though Pax and uh Hujima Flanger Litter elemental fart elemental <laughs> Like what? <laughs> Not all sand is cat litter so fart ele elemental waffle wafted and litter elements were scooped. So I gotta kill these guys, I presume. Alright. I do. I do indeed. I lag a lot when killing these guys. There's a pretty big issue. I would... You'd think there'd be an issue that they can fix, but you never know these days with AQW. What they can and can't fix. Uh, so I just need one more little elemental killed. I can auto attack this guy to death, I guess, but what's the point? Alright. Sweet. Then it'll stand his cat litter. I presume to be a cutscene. Yeah, there we go. Sweet. At this point, Zuri, uh, sorry, Siri, had Ether exactly where he wanted him. No more goofing around or playing games. Zuri, Suri wished it was time to play some games. What? Okay. Alright. Gameception. <laughs> Inception. Oh, hang on. Suri needs some of them cheats codes. Up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, B, A, B, A. Alright. Suri pre purged pre-purchased all the Etho DLC packs, time to play. Okay. Up, up, down, down. My... My... My will just... Okay, okay. This, is, this is quite disgusting. Okay. I'm going up the ladder, I guess. To kill King Strong. Okay. All right, all right, King, King Strong. All right. Wow, that 50 crit is quite powerful. Oh no. I have bested you, King Strong. There is a thing in the way. Do I go up here? Okay, okay. Uh, down here, up, okay, goodbye. All right, this is, this is, this is uh, parodying a lot of games here. Uh, okay, I I've I've bested you. Oh, all right. 
So I was supposed to do quests in here somehow. Uh, oh. Oh, no. Alright, so this is kind of mediocre, I guess. I, I really don't like the lazy... Like, it's just... This seems lazy. I don't know. I think I'm being overcritical here, but... You know? It kind of seems quite lazy. You know? Uh, King... King Strong defeated. So I got to king, kill King Strong, I guess. Uh, I don't know. The, the, the design here it seems kind of lazy. I don't know. I am fairly... Fairly... Uh, I, I don't know. It's just... It's kind of cool, but this 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 area here, especially, kind of annoys me. Um, all right, snack man, power up. I don't know what that means. Oh, so it's not just a maze. You got to collect the power ups. All right, one over here. This is where I think the game like could use some more like. This, this is where the game would really shine if it had some more um more interfacing and stuff like it just we just had like more more a more robust interface all right so what's my next quest i got a ghost busting can i just kill all of them from here all right kind of a pointless quest uh set the music on why don't we I don't know, I guess I'm just kind of being cr overcritical here. This is where the game just really needs some more, uh... I don't know, the game just doesn't really, d doesn't do this kind of thing well. Um, am I killing the right monsters? Yeah, I am. I definitely am. Alright, well, what else am I supposed to be killing? Turtle shells. It's turtles, I guess, but I'm not. None of them are dropping. Damn it! We some goddamn turtles. I'm just presuming he's gonna die. Yeah. They're not dropping. Do I go and collect them from somewhere? There you go, this one. Alright. Now they're dropping. Everything we need. Let's turn it in. Oh. Oh. Alright. It's a me. Hokio. Alright. Don't even need a solo in class with this man. See you later, Hawk man. I should turn that in before I uh, leave. Alright. Me so corny. <laughs> I get it because it sounds like horny. Uh, huh. Corn minion. Corn man. Hey, Christian, get it because it's corn man. Uh, 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 I might as well just stay in this room. Me nom you long time? Oh, Jesus. Cringe shit. So they're getting slight, slightly increased health, and is this level a bit higher? It is a bit higher. All right. Pretty, pretty good event so far. I'm enjoying it. Just that little game bit back there seemed to kind of, uh, I guess, rushed. Picked up a golden coin. All right. Big stack of golden coins. I only pick up one. Seems legit. All right. The hero jumped on in. All right. 
Siri, we need to talk right now. Hey, calm down. This is where the story gets good. And to be honest, is your source of uh, power your necklace? Oh man, you guessed it. The Amulet of Wishes. So you got a special prize. Siri wishes Scarlett was the most beautiful woman in the entire world. Oh. Why do you look the same? I already was the most beautiful woman in the entire world. Seems legit. OMG, lean in there a second. Are your eyes mirrors? I <laughs> do you have any sunscreen? Intention, behold, the prophecy of Kitty Boo Boo. Legend said once once day a hero would one day, sorry, not once day. One day a hero would take the, the trials of Bacon Cat Force, where destiny shall decide for you uh, a spirit animal, animal. A smell. A non web safe color with an interesting and hard to remember name. I like Poos. Uh, yeah, I don't know, I'm pronouncing it Poos. Only then can you be a member of the Bacon Cat Force. Who wants in? Seriously? No one wants to join? You know, ever since Suri was ever since Suri was little, he always been different. Unlike the other Sneevels, Suri, yeah, Suri never liked boxes. Suri was always made fun of for spending his time talking about vampires, dragons, and robots. All Suri ever wanted to, wanted to be was big and looked up to, but Suri is so small. That is why none of you deserve to join the Bacon Cat Force. Only the chosen one, which I presume will be me. My screen is black. All right, I love it. Wow. Wow. All right, looks like I'm rejoining. Yeah, can I teleport back to like event map? All right. Uh. Here. No, already done this. All right. I guess at least I can teleport back here. All right, let's go down the well. Scent trail. Smell this. Smell of freedom. Oh. Uh. I guess I'm killing these guys. Over right the third one. All right. Bam. Really? One didn't drop. A single one. Alright, smell this complete. Let's turn that in. Turn that baby in. Trial of being too small. Powder butter, scoot of, of potatoes. So I'm just gonna kill these guys. Yep. As I presumed. The gameplay in AQW has never been interesting for me. So I'm just really just... It's almost like these parts of the game. I'm just sort of... Uh, trudging, trudging through, is that the right word? No, just sort of like wading through the boring gameplay. <coughs> Excuse me. I guess it's not boring farming for something you really want, but like, this sort of gameplay has never really that be been interesting for me. It's never been fun. Uh, well, it used to, you know, like when you, when you were farming and all the cool items you wanted, but now it's just sort of like, I've done so much farming and so much grinding in this game, it's just not fun anymore. Really lost a lot of its fun. I don't know, now that you look at it, I know I, I, that I look at obje it objectively, it just sort of doesn't seem fun to me anymore. I love how I'm getting all butter monsters now, and I, and I need fucking potatoes. Alright. Oh god, I need a cough. I don't want to cough on video again. <coughs> Jesus. Alright. Hey, potato nuts. Why'd I get a butter monster? Oh my god, it takes so long to kill as well. Well, in comparison to the potato knights they do. Alright, here we go, come on. Yeah, didn't even have to wait for the other ones. Cool, turn that in. King of the unbred. Alright, seems legit. Unbred. Hello, unbred man. How are you doing today? Alright, turn that in. Cutscene. That's what, that's what we're wanting for. Well, that's what we're wanting for. Waiting for. Siri, when did, when exactly did you kill Etho? 
kill him. I did not say I killed him. Yes, you did. <laughs> no, I said I made him dead. Like, I wish Ether was dead. That is so cheating. Yeah, I'm calling hacks. Unbelievable. Where I have failed, Siri has slain Siri has slain the hero and made him his undead servant. Not exactly. Ether is pretty darn resilient. So here is what happens next. All right. Undead armor. Siri wishes. De sorry, Siri decided to try his hand at directing a movie. Siri the sequel. Uh, yeah, I guess sequel. Ziri. See, I want to pronounce it Ziri because they are adding z uh, Z's for no reason now. Like, for just in front of things to make them different. But I'm pronouncing it Siri because in-game, there was actually a thing that came up in chat where, like, they were joking about Siri activating, like, just saying the name Siri will activate an iPhone thing, which means that you have to probably pronounce it Siri. So, I don't know. Uh, same shop as before. Let's get this music back on. Quests. Okay, so Evil Undead. Uh, cardboard Chainsaw Prop. Alright, looks like I'm killing these guys. It's another thing, they do make the classes very broken and very powerful in this in this game. I hope a lot of what I'm complaining about is fixing the severy, right? Although it does seem like a big, big task. It seems like a kind of too much work to make this game better, you know? Hey, they're using the same haircut as me though. That's Foxhawk. If you didn't know. That's the Shadow. Shadowfall big uh, castle thing that crashed. Really? Out of three, none of them dropped the last one. Alright. Let's see how it is. I do not want that. Alright. Paladin. Paladin give a widgey. Give a widgey. So I guess I gotta beat up paladins. Paladin actors. Alright. This look like shit. So I'm gonna go ahead and presume that there's gonna be more paladins in the next room. Oh god, that is not another paladin. Alright. Okay. This is not making me look good. I, got, I gotta click the blinding light destiny just for the fucking meme value. Comedic value, I should say. Because, you know, blinding light destiny is an undead. Weapon. It'd be good if you equip the blinding light destiny, just killed you instantly like this. Uh, so, so we finally came to the glorious moment where we would do battle. Oh no, Siri, you didn't. Oh yes, Siri did. Siri, I did. Siri unleashed the wrath of the Kitty Boo Boo, the overlord, overload of the Catverse. <laughs> what exactly is Kitty Boo Boo? Half cat, half chicken, half yogurt, half clowns. That's four halves. You're really bad at math. This is the prophecy. The snizzle fanizzle just got real. Kitty boo apocalypse. Kitty boo boo apocalypse. Wow. So 20k health. We're looking at we're looking at killing. Uh, look at we're looking at killing this guy. All right. So let's take a look at a class I can kill Mr. Kitty boo boo here with. Uh, you know what? We're gonna do it with a dragon. No, we're not doing it with dragon. We'll do something with interesting. Uh, mystical dark cast. Let's just re re remember how this class works. Uh, is that your heal? All right, I think I can help you solo this with this. Chill your ass over here, mate. I'm just gonna spam the abilities. I don't really know what's what with this class anymore. I, for I forgot how it worked. All right, I can't use anything. Oh, that's right, you stun yourself. God, this is not the right class to use. All right, I'm getting annoyed now. I'm getting frustrated. Just get out of here. I, I feel as though Abyssal Angel is the way to go with this one. Nope. Oh, you know what? I'm just going to get Blaze Mind up. YOLO. Am I right? No, I'm not right at all. Alright, Blaze Binder, here we go. Soloing. Yeah, damn right. you damn right you are. So, I guess I'm going to not kill Siri. If I do, I'll be annoyed. That'd be, that'd be disappointing. Uh, see, the game isn't very good at making things seem climactic. Especially with that goddamn same song. It's not, is this supposed to be climactic? Because I'm not feeling too hyped or anything. Especially considering this boss is the easiest bullshit in the world. Kill. The scale is really not portrayed well. Alright, it's a very long quest name. 
Kitty Boo Boo, no. I killed it. Woo! <coughs> Excuse me. Oh. No, I skipped it! No! Oh, no. Oh, I don't, I don't want to look at this. Oh, God. It's too much. Too much to handle. Let's go back. Yes. Go back. Oh, God. I've spoiled it. That's supposed to be really climactic. Damn it. All right. Uh. Ah. Uh, I guess. Uh, am I going here? Yeah, here we go. All right. By the way, that was Discord activating. No. It can't be. It can't be true. It can't be true. In all fairness, I've been trying to tell you this for the last few cutscenes. It was all a lie. I wish this was not a lie. It was a freaking lie. That, ne that necklace never grounded wishes, did it? No. Wait, Siri, you actually believed everything you have been saying? Wait, what? Of course he believed. The amulet was real, but it doesn't grant wishes. It just makes you think everything you wished for came true. A amulet of illusion? Brainwashing? Best prank ever? This is so embarrassing. <laughs> it was all in your head. Man, if only Etho had put it on, that thing on. Oh, he did. What? Oh, this is gonna be good. What does a hero wish for? It's gonna be an epic troll. So Etho picked up the amulet and put it on. Alright, there we go. Let's be putting it on. I wish for one billion ACs. Yeah. Yeah. I wish I was a mod. Million gold, infinite wishes. Battle my most worthy em enemy. And I guess I'm going to this place. No, all right. I'm going to this place. No, no, all right. I guess I'm going over here. Go fight yourself. OMG, mods are fighting. See, my, none of my color custom stuff works. It looks terrible. Still cool, though. Still a great night. Still a great night. Hey, you guys know who I'm quoting? No fear. Siri is not happy about this. Stop hitting yourself. Defeated yourself. Oh, God. Why have I so much health? Alright. Alright, so let's attack this guy. Do you deal good damage? Oh, he really doesn't. It's a normal enemy. Hey, Etho, stop hitting yourself, maggot. Get wrecked. Who are the mods in the background? Lewis is for Thomas Wolf. Polearm. Alright. That's what we're talking about here. Yeah, I wish this fight was actually difficult, but you know. Alright, cool. Almost killed him. We almost killed him. With a fucking blaze binder. We almost done a solo wing battle with a blaze binder. Alright, we did it. We killed him. Yeah, goodbye. Uh, music stops, so I guess cutscene's gonna play automatically. Cool. Alright. <laughs> oh man, this is as good as it gets. Am I the only one who feels bad for Siri and Etho? Yes. Well, it's about time. Time to hear about Etho and time to hear of when Etho entered my death pit arena. Before you start, Pax, I have one question for you for Siri. Siri? Yes. What was your real reason for going to the inn and seeing Etho? Here, I wrote you a note. None of your business. <laughs> were you really trying to kill Etho, or were you there to going to meet him for some other reason? Siri doesn't need to take this from you. Siri is going to be big one day. You just watch. Siri's not, not a small thinker like the rest of you. Siri has dreams, ambitions, and is, and is never going to give up. Remember that? Remember the day you first heard of the Bacon Cat Force? Remember it. Just like there are things... Wait, what? Just like there are things Siri will never forget. Thank you for your fan letter. Follow your dream and never give up to my biggest fan, Etho. Wow. Wow, that's amazing. Did I just finish the event? I think I did. Look, it's me. That is me. Wow. Wow. Uh, I'll be able to tell by looking at the map, I believe. If I go to the map. And I, uh... 
I go down to, uh, I go up to, rather, up to uh, Throne of Darkness. Are we going to see a tick? Yep, that's it done. Throne of Darkness. We've got three more areas to do. So we're halfway, we're pretty much halfway through the, the, uh, the like, the side stories. So I guess we've got Death Arena, then four dimension, Fourth Dimensional Pyramid, which will be Sects, and then we got the the girl, I can't remember her name. Yeah, it's pretty cool, pretty cool event, guys. I still think the first one was probably the best. Um, although, I don't know. I guess they're all pretty good. That was really good as well. I really did enjoy that. Um, if you guys did enjoy the video and you enjoyed it with me, then by all means, leave a like down below. Uh, while you're down there, leave some leave some feedback. If you want to leave any feedback regarding the event, leaving uh, regarding the uh, the storyline or whatever, or the maybe even the video itself, if you want to, want to uh, talk about what I did wrong in this video or anything, or if I was being an idiot somehow, I don't know. I guess just to leave whatever you want down there. And if you haven't already, subscribe to my channel. I'll be playing through all the parts of this event. Um, and this is kind of like a walkthrough, I guess, although I'm reacting to it live, so I can't really be giving you guys precise information on anything. So, yeah, I guess. But uh, yeah, it's pretty. It's pretty. Uh, it's pretty useful for those of you who want to be guided through this event, I suppose. Or it's more or less a way of us playing it together, reacting to it together, experiencing it together. Either way. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.